Hi guys, today I'm going to be showing you the latest update to the Govi app and this takes things to a completely different level and it blows other systems away completely. So what they've done here, their TV immersion kit, you can see with the camera mounted on top of my TV there, it can work in conjunction with other RGB products from them so you can get a more immersive feel in your whole room. So you can add in multiple devices and get it syncing different regions according to what's happening on the screen. So this is something I asked Govi about many years ago when I reviewed one of their products and finally they've done it and really impressed at how well it works. Now let's jump in and have a look at the app. So I've already updated it and coming into the app, first thing you'll notice, there's a change where you can have different rooms now. So you can see all for all the products I've got and then coming across, you can see what I've got in my office, my living room and my studio there. So that's quite good. So you can group things together in different rooms and then above at the top, you can see devices and then group. You can group different devices together in different rooms to do different actions on them. So you could have the same color going in certain devices at the same time, certain color schemes going on at the same time. And then this is the interesting bit. So if I go over to command, this is where you can set up the syncing with the immersion kit. So I've already got it going. Now coming in here, you can see the options available. So you've got delete in the corner, then you've got studio sync. That's the name of the setup I've got. So if I turn it off here, it will turn those lights off and it's not syncing anymore. So it'll just work independently. You can rename it from here too. Let's turn it back on again. Coming down below, you can see it's connected here via Bluetooth. They're just highlighting here that it's in beta testing phase at the moment. So if you do have any issues, you can report it to them and they'll get it fixed as quick as possible. Scrolling down, you can see all the devices that are linked into the immersion kit. Now going over to manage the device, these are devices that are linked in with this. So I can just tick it and it's selected. So not all devices work with this. Obviously these are all Govi devices that will work in conjunction with this. To be sure you're gonna get a product that works with this, just make sure the hardware version is 3.02.01 or higher. If we come out of this, now this is the interesting bit. If I go to area setting, and this is where the whole room's laid out. You can place devices around your room and then on the light strip or even the glide bar or hexa light, you can pick which area it will sync with. So looking on the picture, you've got different numbers here and that's what correlates to what's on the device. So if you look on the glide wall lights, there's six, six, five, five and four, four and that comes in to the side there. So as the colors are coming around, it will marry up to that and it will try to mimic those colors. And it's not just on the front wall, it will go to the sides as well and the back together with the ceiling as well. So really impressed at how it sinks in. And you can see for yourself there, it works pretty well with the color wheel. And simple to configure as well. So if I click on a section there, I can say what color I want it to represent. So I just click on the number, so seven's over there. I can say that part represents seven. So really impressed. They've finally upped their game to such a level. I think they've just blown away the competition with this update. Scrolling down, you've got some additional options as well. So you've got brightness levels on here. Brightness levels are really good. If I take it up to 100, really stands out. I'll take the brightness level down to give you a better representation on camera. Then we've got saturation levels. If I take that up to the max, color saturation is very strong on there. Let's take it down to the lowest level. Probably gives more of an accurate representation. I'll take it up just slightly on there just to see what happens with that. Let's take it back down. You can see the transitions happening. Accuracy wise, it's not too bad. You can see with the color wheel going around, there are inconsistencies at times as the camera's trying to pick this up and there will be delays as the camera's trying to keep up with what's happening and then obviously pass that on to the other devices going around. Now coming down below, you've got part or all, and that's the different parts of the colors. If I go to all, it will just stick to a single color on there, going back to part, and that's really the one you wanna use with this. Then you've got game, so that's if you're gaming, or go to movie if you're gonna be watching a movie with this. Just gives better performance 
in the movie side of things. Now below that, you've got sound effects. So if I turn that on, any sound effects happening, it will work in conjunction with that. That's probably a better place if you've got a music video playing, so it sort of fits in better and it will go along with the music. But if you're watching a movie, I think it will be too distracting to have that on. You've got different levels with this as well, softness wise. If I take it right down, a bit more reactive on there. So I'll turn that off for now. So there you go, really impressed with this. So let me play some sample footage next and you can see it in action in different scenarios. So in summary, really impressed with the latest update from Govi. They've taken their devices to the next level with this immersion kit syncing with other devices. I think they've blown away the competition completely with this. So I hope it's helped anyone thinking of upgrading their setup and adding some more immersion in there. And if you're new to the channel, hope you can subscribe and hit that bell icon to be notified of my next release. Thanks for viewing and see you in the next one.